today we will be looking at the fall of Rome. Rome ruled much of Europe around the Mediterranean for a, over a hundred, a thousand years. However, the inner workings of the Roman Empire began to decline starting around 200 AD. By 400 AD, Rome was struggling under the weight of its giant empire. The city of Rome finally fell in 476 AD, the peak of Roman power. Rome reached its pow peak of power in the 2nd century, around the year 117 AD, under the rule of the great Roman Emperor Trajan. Virtually all, all of the coastline along the Mediterranean Sea was part of the Roman Empire. This included Spain, Italy, France, southern Britain, Turkey, Israel, Egypt, and northern Africa. A gradual decline. The fall of Rome didn't happen in a day. It happened over a long period of time. There are a number of reasons why the empire began to fail. Here are some of the causes of the fall of the Roman Empire. The politicians and rulers of Rome became more and more corrupt. Infighting and civil wars within the empire. Attacks from barbarian tribes outside of the empire, such as the Huns, Franks, and Vandals. The Roman army was no longer a dominant force. The empire became so large it was difficult to govern. Rome divides into two. In 285 AD, Emperor Diocletian decided that the Roman Empire was too big to manage. He divided the empire into two parts, the Eastern Roman Empire and the Western Roman Empire. Over the next hundred years or so, Rome would be reunited, split into three parts, and split into two again. Finally, in 395 AD, the empire was split into two for good. The Western Empire was ro ruled by Rome, and the Eastern Empire was ro ruled by by Constantinople. The fall of Rome discussed here is referring to the Western Roman Empire, which was ruled by Rome. The Eastern Roman Empire beca became known as the Byzantine Empire and remained in power for another thousand years. The city of Rome is sacked. The city of Rome was thought to be, by many, to be unconquerable. However, in 410 AD, a Germanic tribe called the Visigoths invaded the city. They looted the treasures, killed and enslaved many Romans, and destroyed many buildings. This is the first time in 800 years that the city of Rome had been sacked. Rome Falls In 476 AD, a Germanic barbarian by the name of Odacer took control of Rome. He became king of Italy and forced the last emperor of Rome, Romulus August <coughs> Augustulus, to give up his crown. Many historians consider this to be the end of the Roman Empire. The Dark Agents began. With the fall of Rome, many changes occurred throughout Europe. Rome had provided a strong government, education, and culture. Now much of Europe fell into barbarianism. The next 500 years would be known as the Dark Ages of Europe. Thank you.